crash that left the school community devastated. November 2021, beloved Lower Marion High School principal Sean Hughes killed while driving his teenage son to soccer. Today, the man who caused that crash, speeding and running a stop sign, learned his sentence. Action News reporter Sharifa Jackson was there in the courtroom today. She joins us now live tonight. Sharifa, this was an incredibly emotional day on all sides of this tragedy. You know, right, Brian, emotional on all sides. Family and friends came to show their support for that Lower Marion High School principal and also the defendant face to face with them. He not only pled guilty, but he also apologized. I watched my husband, my best friend, my partner in life die in front of me. Inside the Camden County courtroom, tears and heartache shared from the widow of Sean Hughes. The last horrific 19 months are just the beginning of a lifetime of sadness, anger, and devastation that you created. Christie's impact statement directed to Azuka Asai, a Camden County judge sentenced 55 year old Asai to five years of probation, 90 days of house arrest and 30 days of community service. Asai caused the crash that killed 51 year old Sean Hughes in November of 2021. It was an act of gross negligence. There's no doubt about that. Investigators say Asai was speeding and ran a stop sign before colliding with Hughes Ford SUV at the intersection of Fleming Pike and Hayes Road in Winslow Township. At the time, Hughes was taking his 13 year old son to soccer practice. Hughes was a husband, father of three, beloved principal at Lower Marion High School for 14 years. He knew every single student by name. He knew every staff member. He knew the bus drivers. He knew the cafeteria workers and he knew the custodians. Azuka Asai's attorney says he moved to the U.S. in 2006 to make a better life for his family. His clean record heavily influenced his sentencing. Today, Asai tells the Hughes family and friends he regrets his actions. I don't have much to say. Um, profound uh, apology. I'm deeply sorry for my heart. In addition to his sentencing, Asai was ordered to pay various fines, and he also agreed to pay $5,000 in restitution to the family. We're live in Camden, Sharifa Jackson, Channel 6, Action News. Brian? Yeah, as we said, a difficult day all around. Sharifa, thank you. And